Hey guys, I know it took forever for me to upload a video, but uh, I've just been really busy with school. And it was midterm, so I had a lot of finals and all that I had to deal with. And uh, it just didn't really, really work out that I could make a video. Like, I've been playing RuneScape, but first of all, I, I really didn't have any idea of what to make anyway. I'm working on my QBD guide, so that's pretty much taking a lot of my attention right now. And uh, I just want to make this quick video so you guys aren't left forever without a video. So this video is exactly what the title says. It's uh, I'm going to be showing you guys my uh, Herbalore tab or whatever uh, for my overloads. And I'm also going to be spending all my points at the World Event, which finished a few days ago actually. Um, I have, let's see how many points. I don't know how much I actually have. I have 1.2 mil nearly. Um, so that's a lot of lamps actually. Uh, I think each, yeah, each huge one is 25,000. So I'm going to get a lot of lamps and I'll get to that in a second. So yeah, before I get into anything, uh, I just wanted to show you my uh, gear set I have right now. Uh, this is pretty much my skilling outfit right now. I really, really like it. I don't know about you, you probably wouldn't like it, but I just think it looks really nice. The armor set is from uh, Rune Memories, which is a really easy quest, and I can't believe I didn't do it until like two weeks ago. I think it just really looks nice. I mean, the gloves and boots are kind of lame. The best I have right now is Armadil. Um, I could get like steads or something, but they're rising. I'd rather not buy them. And then I'm just wearing some farming stuff. So yeah, I really like this gear and uh, I'll probably wear this until completion is cape and then I'll probably ch change it up. So I'm going to buy one lamp, show you how much XP it gives me. And then, um, then I'll just skip up to the end and show you how much I get. So I don't have to waste your time uh, watching me open a bunch of lamps. So let's see how much I get. 65,000. Wow, that's actually really good. So 65,000 from one lamp, it was that's some that's actually really good. And considering um I got 16.2 mil construction from the event, uh, I think I got like 2 million or more experience uh from that event. I really really liked it and enjoyed it. Um and then I'm also getting a bunch of agility, which I just hit 15 million. That's amazing. So let's see what I get at the end and uh, I'll meet you guys there. All right, as you can see, 3.1 mil agility experience in like five minutes of opening lamps. So now I'm at 18 point, about 18.1, I'd say, because I still got to do a little stuff. Uh, 18.1 mil agility, and I still got 800k bonus. So I'm pretty much set for 20 mil agility, which that's awesome. Like, it's one of my higher skills now. That's surprising because, uh, honestly, I hate agility, and uh, honestly, I use all my lamps on it. And some people do like their lamps on divination, but I don't because divination is a really easy skill, honestly. It's AFK for me, and you can't do that with agility. I um, mean, until, unless they do like the rework, which makes it AFK. I don't know if they're ever going to do that, but uh, it's a possibility. But right now, agility is the worst skill to get experience in, and I'd rather do that. So I think I'm going to go to the bank and show you my overloads now. All right, so here's the bank. It's really disorganized right now. And if you've seen my bank video, this was a lot more organized, and I had, honestly, a lot more overloads too. I've been using them. That's why I'm starting to make 2,000, because I'm really running out, and I use these, like, everywhere. So, yeah, um... I decided to buy 2,000 overloads worth of supplies, which is about 120 mil actually, which that's actually pretty cheap considering I thought it was going to be like 150 mil. So right there, I saved 30 mil based on my estimate. And uh, now I'm broke, as you can see. If you've seen, I had 100k cash. So yeah. Well, so far I've made around 250 attack and I've made all my super strength because I wanted to get the dwarf weeds out of here I so you don't see how much I have because I'm going to be saving it for a loot video later and I have haven't started on the super defense and I, I did 1300 super ranges because surprisingly they're really AFK and I like doing them and they're good experience um, for the mage pots I do have the magic pots but uh, they are they are in my Sarah tab because she drops it so I can't bring anything in there so it's in there um, and then I'm starting to grind all my mud runes so yeah it's a lot of work I'd say kind of afk but eh, i don't really like herbal uh, like as a whole the skill i don't really like it but uh i do need to do it for my overloads and for xp and most people like consider overloads as like complete loss like every time i use an overload i lose 60k or whatever how much it is but i really don't think that way and uh only a few people agreed with me on this but uh you can think of it anyway but i think of it like optimistically where I don't count these as money loss because I spend this kind of money right here, 120 mil, on the Herbalore experience. Not always just for the overload, it's for the experience. Like 120 mil is 4.2 mil uh, Herbalore experience, which is around 30 GP per XP, which I'm happy to do that and I'm not sad that I'm losing all that money because it's 4, mil 4 million Herbalore experience. So honestly, I, 
I consider the overloads as byproduct. And when I use them, I don't feel bad because they're just byproduct. I'm going to be making overloads anyways, so why not just use them? And whenever I go for 200 millage uh, herbalor, I am definitely going to be making like 10,000, 20,000 overloads or something. So I'll probably never run out. 2,000 will last me a long time, but probably I'll run out within like a year because I PVM all the time for loot videos. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I'm um, sorry it was kind of short. And uh, I, I'm sorry I didn't really have a huge topic or anything. But yeah, I've just been really busy. And uh, I'm just glad I got it out. And uh, next few weeks, actually, is going to be a lot of good content. So I'll uh, look forward to that. And I'll see you guys in the next video, guys.